are doing it properly this time. Apparently, I always have to have problems with my lives. It's just how it is. But okay. Hello, everyone. We're back. Hello, hello, hello. I'm just gonna wait for some people to join and then. Hello, D'Angelo. Thank you for coming. I can always count on you to be here. Okay, guys, I'm sorry. This is a little bit of a rough start. Um, so I tried, I'm just going to quickly say this. I tried to set a schedule, which is you guys were all like waiting and everything for it. And then, um, but it, it, I guess the auto lock was on when I did it. So there's no spider, but I'll be a spider. Anyway, um, yeah, so like, <sighs> I don't know what happened, but like it wasn't turned properly. So the live chat was like facing standing up and I would have had to like keep my head like this the whole time. So anyways, guys, we're here. If you were in the first one, again, we have another fail, another blooper one. <sighs> anyways. Hi, Abigail. Okay, guys, so tell me, how is your day? Rate it on a scale of 1 to 10. Rate your day on a scale of 1 to 10, guys. How did... How did you guys like your day today? 61850? Oh, why? Mer says, all it is 7 to 8. That's good. That's good. 10, 7... Seven, seeing a lot of sevens. D'Angelo says a seven. Seven is like mediocre, you know. It's like a, like on the, like a bit better than like an average day. Ten. Abigail said ten. Hi, Layla. Hi, Layla. Thank you for joining. I'm seeing a lot of fives as well. So some people had okay days. And because you went live Yay. um so guys i know a lot of you were saying that i was late and i was you know gotta be fashionably late um but i wanted to get a to say my name on it no good um hi cameron hi cameron hi cameron um i really wanted bubble tea earlier but I was like, oh, I'll time it out perfectly so that I get it in time for the live. So I thought that some people might enjoy this. Being fashionably late. I, guys, fun fact about me, I am always late at this point. It's pretty much, pretty much just a um, personality trait. Like I'm just always late. It's just how it is. Abigail asks, how old am I? I'm 20 years old. And Natalie asks, what part of Canada I'm from? I'm from Ontario, Canada. So yes, I see some people in here. NFs, man. You guys know I'm terrible at pronouncing things. So, um, hello. <laughs> Thank you for being here. Um, a lot of, I see a lot of people who, um, comment on my videos a lot, which love to see you guys here. So yes, feel free. You thought I was from Texas. No. Kidding. That top is cute. Thank you, Aunt Angel. Not sure how to say that, but I made it, guys. I'm not gonna um I'm not gonna get up because it's just gonna make too much noise. But if you guys wanna see the full top, I posted it on my Instagram story. I made it. I finished it today. Um and it's really hot in here, so I had to um keep something nice and like warm on and if man thought i was from nyc no but i would love to be from there why um lauren asks why i started an asmr channel and honestly i have been watching asmr for like i think it's been almost seven years coming up and I always loved it and actually you guys fun 
fun fact um, is that when I was like younger, I would make pretend YouTube videos and I made pretend ASMR videos. So I was like 13 years old being like, hello, welcome back to my ASMR video. And I was like, pretending that I was gonna upload it because I wanted to be a YouTuber really bad when I was younger so I'd make pretend videos and I made pretend ASMR videos and so I guess part of that eventually I just decided to get the courage to do it and my parents also didn't let me um have a YouTube channel and so that's now that I'm I started it a couple years ago so yeah I just made it because I love I love ASMR and I just like making videos and my sister, stupid Rachel, <laughs> cute top, huh? where is it from? I made it, he. <laughs> okay, anyways, yes guys, so ask me questions, like do, um, that's the point of this live, um, the live triggers are probably gonna be some, like, Ricardo asks what products I use for my hair, so I use mostly Shea Moisture stuff, to be honest with you, um, I use a Shea Moisture line for shampoo and conditioner, as well as um, the Curl Enhancing Smoothie, and then I just use like a gel and a bonnet at night. Aureli says, hi Talina, I just want to take a second to thank you for simply having this platform and safe space for all of us. I love all your videos. I wish you so much positivity in your life. Love you. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, and I'm so happy that I can be here and make videos for you guys and help you guys relax and stuff um am i in college um asks um Lid ladarius i'm technically yes in college i'm in university it's just in canada college is university and then american version of our college is community college the crowner asks if i speak french no my dad speaks french Never taught me. Sadly. Thank you, Samuel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, but yeah. So, I'm gonna take a sip of this. I tried so hard not to drink this on the way home because I normally finish. Guys, there's fireworks. I had a feeling that was gonna happen. I had a feeling. Guys, guess, guess what flavor this is. at all. <laughs> Want some of that deep mango? Close, kind of. Lychee mango. No one has said the right answer yet. fruit still still not the right answer guys do you guys have cha time where you're from it's not orange it's grapefruit and it's so good i also have the little tapioca pearls and the coconut jelly no you guys don't have cha time says Brittany. and it's a shame Yes, grapefruit. Whoever, somebody did say grapefruit. Elliot, I think. That was. You're correct. You're, I think you're the only one who said it. Ladarius asks what my favorite music genre is. And I have to say rap, hip-hop, but I also like alternative music as well. I honestly, I listen to a lot of different types of music because I have a pretty far drive to work every day. I have a half an hour drive there and then back, so I get tired of my music a lot, so I'm constantly just changing it up. 
Moonlight slows us if I like K-pop. And to be honest, I don't think so. I don't think so. I don't really listen to it too much. Do I like Drake? Yes, I love Drake. I love Drake. He's probably my favorite rapper. I don't care what anybody says. If you think he's like, if that's like a obvious thing to say or it's like, okay, like, come on. Like, he's like too mainstream, but I love him. People saying Drake's overrated. I do see how people can think that. But, I don't know. I love him. Um, Ray Ray asked where I got my top from. And I actually made it. And I'm actually thinking of starting a Depop for tops like this soon. So if I do, I'll tell you guys about it and you can check it out. Because I make... Oh, and also, okay, I'm gonna... The top, I don't want to stand up too much. But it's like a color block. So I put like burgundy and orange. I don't want to stand up too much because it's just too much work. But yeah. So if I end up selling tops like this, just I'll let you guys know and you can check it out if you would like. Favorite color? Uh, ask a sinful neon 999 probably honestly all colors but i like purple should sell jewelry on depop i do i have the stuff to make earrings and um yeah i could i could sell some stuff on there too and people talking about j cole i do like him he is very good i think when it comes to J. Cole, he's very, his lyrics are so good. Like, he just tells a whole story in his songs and it's, it's just, it's, like, I can appreciate good lyrics very much. And he's really talented in that way. Samuel asks who my favorite Ace artist is and, um... Honestly, you guys, I listen to so many, but Grace V, it's Jenda Whispering. Love them. Um, my ask is about if I have a Patreon, and I do. It's something I was going to mention in this stream anyways, but yes, I do have a Patreon. So, it's in the description. You guys will find it. Um, if you want to click on the link and um, see, the more, see more information about it, but... Um, you get four videos a month for five dollars, and that's Canadian. And I know that American, it's it's cheaper in American dollars. So yeah, but yeah, I really like the videos. I I um I've been putting on Patreon, and the ones that I will be putting on. So definitely check it out if you like my content. Lauren asks what I major in college and where I work. Um, I can't really say where I work, but it's a government, I work in a government job, um, and I study criminology in school. I mean, I just finished my third year. So, yeah. Oh, this hurts my back. Can you do mic scratching very gently? Okay, I'll try, guys. But the thing is, is it's very hard. Because I can't hear it. I can't hear it. I can't hear it. I really need to get some earbuds. Actually, guys, I do have a pair of earphones right here. Where I could hear it. But they're like big, ugly ones. So, like, I don't want to put them on. Do I look like drippy red? I do. video. <laughs> if you guys were here last time, you remember the crusty brush. <laughs> this brush 
the story about this brush is that um I <laughs> um it was on my floor for like months and in my last live stream I was like oh guys I'll do some like brushing and I picked it up off the floor and everyone was like oh my god crusty brush And I actually used this brush. Did I use it in a video? I think I used it in a video recently, but I didn't like how the video turned out. So I'm not, I might end up uploading it. I think I'm just being too hard on myself to be honest, but um, yeah, it's funny. Crusty brush. <laughs> Richard is asking my opinion on YB, but I don't know who that is. I'm sorry, I can't answer your question. Who's YB? Young. I don't know. <laughs> um, I do know who that is. Okay, guys, don't roast me. Don't roast me, don't roast me. Um, he, I don't know too many of his songs. To be honest, I could not name one. But I think he is like, I'm sure he's like a decent rapper. I only know him because my friend, one of my friends told me that. Because his name, his name used to be NBA young boy never broke again, but he had to take out the NBA because it was like copyrighted or something Like that's really embarrassing <laughs> Music sucks these days. Let's be honest. You know what a lot of music is terrible these days and I Don't really I don't know Okay, what about juice world? Okay, just juice world is pretty good rest in peace rest in peace you ask what my favorite food is bubble tea and cheesecake but Japanese cheesecake have you guys ever had Japanese cheesecake oh we have De Deja Deja ASMR here hello love to see you in the lives Beyonce <laughs> you guys know that meme it's like Beyonce <laughs> Thank you to the people that are saying that I look like her. That is probably one of the best compliments that I could ever hear because Beyonce is amazing. You had said you gained lots of hobbies, so have you ever skated? Okay, no. I have not like, if you mean skated like on ice, which you probably don't mean, I'm assuming you mean skateboarding. Um, no, I've never skateboarded. But what I will say is that um, I want to be a skater. <laughs> mm, that was really cringe when that came out of my mouth. But I think, I don't know. I feel like skateboarding is really cool. And if a guy skateboards, I mean, I, I just think that that's like very cool. And if my boyfriend skateboarded, then I would just have to skateboard too. Because it's just cool. <laughs> Boba Loki overrated. Okay, no. Take that back right now. This is so good. Moonlight says I want to try Boba, but I don't know which flavor to try first. So, to be honest, this is not bubble tea. It's not tea. This is just juice. It's just grapefruit juice. I don't like the actual like milk tea kind of stuff. It's just not really my thing. But the very first boba that I ever tried was peach and it was so good. So I feel like that's a good place to start. 
Um, I have a feeling you're tall. How tall are you? A lot of people say that, but I'm just average height. I'm like 5'5", five five, maybe a little, maybe like 5'5 five five and a half. I don't know. Lauren asks about Olivia Rodrigo's new album, and I just, my friend loves it, and she knows that I'm like, I don't know, like, she wanted to hear my opinion about it because I hate Driver's License. I'm sorry if you like it, but I hate that song with a literal passion. And so, um, she asked me, and I'm not going to lie, you guys, it's better than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was just going to be all, like, mainstream garbage, like, radio garbage, but it honestly isn't too bad. Some of the songs are a bit too slow for my liking, but you know, personal opinion. If you like driver's license, I'm sorry to offend you, but I just, I can't listen to that song. It's just, it's so annoying. Do ASMR with your boyfriend. I don't have a boyfriend, so that's not, it's not possible, but I will be doing ASMR with my friend. If you guys watched my video with my friend Alexis, I'm pretty sure she's going to be in another video soon. So, Deja Vu is better than Good For You in my opinion. I like the, the beat of Good For You better, but I think Deja Vu, I like the lyrics that that one more. Do I like Poosh Ice Tea? Why did he name himself that? Why would you name yourself Poo? Like, <laughs> why would you, like, you choose your rapper name and why would you pick that? But he's pretty decent. I only know a few songs. I only know a few of his songs. And they're pretty good. I can name, like, maybe two off the top of my head. But they're decent. They're decent. <laughs> oh, guys, this is so good. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You guys need to go buy some bubble tea right now because it's <laughs> Why did the rapper Lil Pump fall off? Cool. That's a good question. And you know why I think I think he just his music became garbage. And I actually saw Lil Pump in concert, and this is like years ago. Like, how many years ago would it have been? Like three, four years ago? I saw Lil Pump in concert. He was a literal nobody. Um, it was sick, you guys. That was my first and only mosh pit that I've ever been in. And let me tell you, I almost wanted to like leave because it was so I couldn't breathe in there. It was crazy. But yes, I saw Lil Pump live before he kind of got some hype and then his hype just like died. Excuse me. And I think it died because his music kind of just his music was never really that good. But he just he never progressed to get better. He just came out with garbage music. I'm sorry. The Weeknd or Bryson Tiller asks Mers and The Weeknd. When COVID is over, guys, I'm seeing The Weeknd in concert and nobody is stopping me. I'm going to. <laughs> I need, like, I've been so listening to The Weeknd so much lately, but mostly his older music. That one kid, Noah, asks when I started ASMR and it's coming up to two years very soon, you guys. But I haven't been consistent for two years. I've only been consistent for like December, January, February, March, April, May. Like five, six months I've actually been consistent. The weekend or Brent. I don't know how to say his last name. I'm sorry. But the weekend. That Brent guy does have some decent music as well though. 
My back hurts, guys. <laughs> this is not a cute look. Mers, Mears. Sorry. Mers, <laughs> this is how you read it. <laughs> but sorry, I'll say it right next time. Um, do I listen, listen to 6 9 He does have some decent songs, but I just think that him as a person is just so, like, stop. Like, he just needs to chill. Do you guys hear that gunshot? Oh my god. <gasps> Kidding. It's a firework. Do I listen to Nicki Minaj? Asks Westo too. Yes. Love her. She is the queen of rap. I'm sorry, but she is. She is. Okay, guys. Let's play a game. I don't know what game that we could play. But, um... Nicki Minaj, the queen of rap. Yes, she is. Doja Cat is good though as well. Megan's coming for her spot. I mean, Megan the Stallion is good. Ow. Oh my god, guys, my piercing, my rook piercing, it's like folded back into my ear. That's not fun. This happens sometimes, like very rarely, and it really hurts. Megan the Stallion. Ow. Ow. Megan the Stallion is very good. I love her, but I'm sorry. Nikki was there first. Nikki, even if someone replaces Nikki, she was the first. What about Young MA? Very good as well. Love her. Would I ever get my nose pierced? I do have it pierced. It's a little hoop. Guys, I'm actually, and you know what? This makes sense because my ear was really sore. Hi, Jay's animals. OMG, I'm a huge, huge fan. Please say hi. I think that my earring is just going to be stuck like this. I'm not going to fix it right now. I don't know if you guys understand, but I have my rook pierced right there and it like flipped in. Angel says I want to get a piercing and get one. I have, I think, 15 piercings and they're great. They're amazing. And the second that piercing shops open again from COVID, I will be going. Does anybody have how many piercings do you guys have let's see how many piercings do you guys have today's my birthday well hello and happy birthday cloudy xbl on xbox <laughs> i don't know if i said that right 2 14 okay 2 0 0 15 tattoos. That's it. Mirrors. I said it right. Has three. I'm not going to stop requesting this roleplay till it happens. Canadian slang roleplay says Carrie Berry. And I actually I wrote down that request from you last time. And I would love to do that video soon. It's just I have a lot planned out. And I have like whole schedules. So. Hi, Della. Hi, Della. Hi, Della. My ear is like stinging right now. This isn't good. I'm a boy. I have my ears pierced. Pierce, that counts, right? Yes. <laughs> Rashid says there's always technical difficulties at first. And yes, this is the second time now that I've had technical difficulties in the beginning. And it just kills my vibe. And then I get the vibe back just kills my vibe for a second, you know? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's- oh, I got it. I got it, guys. 
And now you can actually see the piercing. So my rook is right there. It's that little hoop. That was like flipped inside. <sighs> Here we go. It's fixed and I'm happy now. Hi, Elroy. Hi, Elroy. Hello, Darius. That's how many piercings I have. And, um, I don't know the exact number off the top of my head, but I think it's around 15. I can't deal with blood. Honestly, most piercings aren't going to bleed if you get it. But if you guys want piercings, definitely get them. I highly recommend. They're a great way of self-expression and I think I get bored of myself a lot and I just need to change something. So getting a piercing is like a subtle, easy, and effective way to do that. I don't have any tattoos though. I have zero tattoos. Just an ASMR raid. Who is that? What's going on? What's going on? Oh my god. Dye my hair purple. I actually, I dyed it like a maroon color. Like very temporary, but what is going on? What is going on? Is just an ASMR. Should I? Oh my god, y'all. Yeah. What is this? What is this? What's going on? What is going on? Is from another YouTuber? Well, thanks to whoever that person is. I don't really know. I, 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 oh my god. I'll have to, I guess, check him out after, but. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, I was like, can y'all like stop? That's how I read that. Okay, um, I give you full permission to like mute the people that have said it over and over again. At Wesley. <laughs> Your job is really taken off right now. Mute mute all these people. You have a firework. You guys, should I sing? Should I do a singing ASMR? <laughs> Sometimes I sing and I'm like, I can sing. Other times I sing and I'm like, that was terrible. Okay, wait. Is Justin ASMR real? Is he a real person? I need to tell you guys to come here and comment. Or what? Because I'm a little bit confused. These are, oh, hi, hello, Justin ASMR. I see your comment. These are all my people. I just brought over to support your channel. Well, thanks. I was a little bit confused. I was slightly confused of what was going on, but thanks. <laughs> I'll have to check out your channel now. <laughs> that was a little interesting moment there. Oh, I see. That makes sense. Well, thank you. Is this my first raid? Says Alice. Yes, it is. So. Thank you, Void Grower. Says better no piercing. Uh, is that at me? I don't know, but thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I do, can I do a breath? I was descending my stream and I wanted to support the ASMR community. Oh, that's very, very nice of you. Thank you. I will check out your channel and subscribe. Well, thank you for subscribing. Shiny Evie, please. I'm just, I just can't pronounce nothing. Hello, Mohammed.
like I could use a touch up on my lipstick. I actually pronounced it right. I'm happy that I did. Noah asks what my zodiac sign is, and I'm a Capricorn. How did my hair go back so fast? Honestly, my hair has grown very quickly since I cut it. If you guys go back to my video, it's my cupped whispering video from like November or something. My hair is really short. It has grown a lot since then. Guys, it's Victoria Day. Now I have a question. Is Victoria Day universal? Like, do you guys from the States or the UK, wherever you're watching from, do you have Victoria Day? I don't know if that's a dumb question. But I'm from Canada and this is called the May 2-4 weekend. Oh, I guess it's a Canadian holiday, maybe. Victoria Day, I think. I'm, I've never heard of it, but I'm quite young and from the US. Never heard of it, okay, well I guess it's a Canadian thing. So this weekend is called May 2-4 weekend, get it? Cause like, May 24th. Um, and I'm pretty sure it's like a, it's called Victoria Day. Today's a holiday. Um, this Monday, so I didn't have to go to work today. No one had to go to work. Everything was closed. And so, um, I don't know why though. That's a good question to ask. Today is probably a British. Yeah, I think it is like a British thing. But whatever. It's a holiday for me. I didn't have to go to work, so I'm not complaining. But it means there's fireworks. There's been fireworks for three days straight, and my one dog is um, very afraid of fireworks. So I feel very bad for her. Do we have milk bags in Canada? Yes, we do. <laughs> it's not a lie. Like, we actually have milk in bags what does victoria day celebrate i actually don't know that's kind of bad i feel like i should know i think it's something to do with like british stuff i don't know what kind of dog do i have i have two dogs i have a labradoodle named lola and a morky named bella Comment some triggers that I should do. Comment some triggers. Comment some triggers. What are your favorite triggers, guys? Also, I just realized that um, I've been soft speaking this whole time. Charles says, is it too late to open the ASMR trend thinking about making a channel? No, it's not too late. It's never too late. Grown a lot, but it's still relatively small, so 
I'm gonna go back to soft speaking because my throat is getting sore from whispering but if you want to start a channel and you don't have a lot of money if you have an iPhone with a pair of Apple earbuds but they have a mic on there and it makes really good sounds um, I my first mic was $25 from Amazon you guys like you don't need to spend a lot of money so to answer your question I think it was shiny evie underscore place you do not need a lot of money i have a ring light because i already had one because i tried to become a makeup youtuber before this and then i quit after two videos but i already had a ring light but again you can get cheap ones from amazon and you don't need you don't even really need one and then once you kind of get going you can start to up your equipment but honestly you don't need to start with anything crazy i record from my phone all my videos are filmed on my iphone 11 so it's seriously you don't need to have a lot of money <clears throat> hello allison 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 my throat kind of get sore after whispering a lot i don't know if it's because i need to like relax it but it feels like i just did like a workout or something i don't know it's weird you guys so i'm not gonna um whisper anymore <laughs> i don't know it actually and i read a comment from a live stream person um last time in my last live and they were like oh you can actually like damage your vocal cords if you don't whisper properly. I was like, and that stuck with me because I'm like, oh my God, am I whispering properly? Is there a proper way to whisper? I don't know. But lately I've actually been finding like my, my, like my throat gets sore if I talk too much. My alpha looks so fire. Can we see all of it? Um, well, I'm not going to show, I'm, I'm not going to show my bottom half because I'm not wearing a cute, my outfit's not cute on the bottom, but okay guys, you're going to hear my legs peel off the chair because I'm wearing shorts. That's the sound of it, but this is my top. Um, I made it and it is very cute. I love it. Oh, thank you. Um, but yeah, drink a lot of water. I have been drinking a lot of water lately i try to drink a lot of it lately but it's hard man do i have a favorite tv show asks Jaden. yes my favorite tv show is the office if you guys like the office send something in the chat because the office is the best show Allison, to answer your question, my hair routine is too much to say, but I do have a full hair care routine video from a few months back if you would like to see everything I do for my hair. 
um, haven't actually watched it while you're missing out, it's so good. I love it. My favorite character in The Office, it's hard to say because I love a lot of them. Um, I love Stanley because he's just so, like, doesn't care. <laughs> he's just so, like, chill. Oh, I don't know. I love Jim. I love Jim. I love Pam. I love Michael. Dwight is annoying, but I love him. So, yeah. I don't have a favorite. Creed is Loki the funniest, and yeah, he is. He's like, like a Loki character, but it's it's funny. He's funny. He just says like the most like randomest things <laughs> that makes him funny. Happy birthday, Dariella. Dariella. I'm. I hope I'm saying that right. But happy birthday to you. Mystic Chris will ask what my sign is. And I'm a Capricorn. December Capricorn. I'm trying to think about some things I can like ask you guys. Um I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Just subbed, thank you. I just want to like sit back like this, like, hey guys, what's up? Elroy says they're Gemini and, okay, yeah, guys, what are, what are your guys' star signs or astrological signs? I don't know what the heck it is. Yeah, what are your guys' signs? I'm curious to see what the most common ones are. Libra. That just reminds me of this sound. I love Libras. <laughs> Cancer. Let's see what we got. Aquarius, Virgo, Sagittarius. Do we have any other Capricorns? Let's see. Pisces, Gemini, Capricorn, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. What's my dream vacation spot? Costa Rica, or you know what? No, the Maldives. Oh, those little huts. Scorpio, Aquarius, Leo. I'm not seeing one coming up more often than the other. It's there it seem to all be Aries, Pisces, Libra, Pisces. I feel like Pisces is a pretty common one. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. Gemini, Aries. Do I like drawing? I love, I wish I could draw, but I can't draw. If I could, though, it would be in real life and not digital. Leo, Capricorn, Taurus. So I'm seeing a lot. I've seen a lot of Leos, I feel like. Scorpio. Leo, but I don't believe in astrology. Yeah, it's definitely a bit of a... I don't really believe in it too much. I'm not going to lie. Hi. Is Talina your full name? It's really pretty. Just wondering. Um, well, Talina is just my first name, but yeah, it is my real name. And thank you. Leos are pretty common. Yeah, I feel like I've been seeing quite a few Leos up in here. And Pisces as well. I think those were two of the most commonly said ones. Would you like to go to France? Yes, I would love to go to France. One thing about me, guys, is I want to travel so bad. I have so, ugh, just have so many places. I want to go so many things I want to see. And it's just, I don't know when I'm going to have the time and the money. So, but we'll see. One day, I mean, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. How old am I? Um, a lot of people in here, I get asked that quite a few times throughout this stream, and I'm just curious as to what age you guys think I am, and if you know, don't say it, because I say it a lot, because I get asked a lot, but how old do you think I am if you don't know? 
I'm curious because thank you for subscri subscribing, Adrian. Some people, I get kind of surprised because some people think I look older. Some people think I look younger. 21, 22. It all depends too because when I have makeup on, I look older, I think. 22, 17. I'm seeing a lot of 23s. 22s and 23s. So we're kind of a wide range here, but I'm seeing mostly like 22 and 23 and 22 at the most, 21, 24. Only seen a few with the right answer. And so I am actually fourteen. <laughs> I'm not fourteen. Sometimes I wish I was fourteen again though. 19 yes so guys i'm 20 um 20 so some of you guys were right a lot of people were saying like 22 23 which i feel like anyone between the age of like 22 to 23 20 to 23 looks pretty much the same and then i feel like you do start to look a bit older anytime past that but yes i'm 20 um my birthday's in december so i'll be 21 in like half a year my chair is also I'm sitting on a chair, guys. You can't see it, but it's making a lot of noise. Someone said I look older. Honestly, I think it's um, it's it's because of the makeup. Like of, without makeup, I think I look younger. What day in December? Asks Breezy, and my birthday is December 29th, so, yeah, December 29th, I know a surprising number of people with the same birthday as me, it's like two, but still, I feel like it's weird, I'll be 20 in October, not that far apart, yes, we're like almost the same age at DJ ASMR, yeah, we're pretty, we're pretty close in age, um, December 28th, pretty solid, DJ ASMR has when I'll be graduating and you'll be done college next year. So I'm in my third year and my program is four years. So I'm graduating in a year. So like in a year from now, I will be graduating university, which is very scary. Very scary stuff. Look like I live in Florida. Mm -hmm. I wish. Well, do I wish? I don't know. Yeah, we're gonna be graduating at like the same time. Very scary. How long is your hair if you stretch it out? It's very long, like you can't even see it in the frame. I straighten my hair, you guys. I, okay, here's the thing. I'm in my second year technically, but I'm a year ahead in college. Yeah, that is good because it's very stressful. Um, I want to straighten my hair, but it really damages it. And like it damages it for a while. Like, it doesn't go back to being the same. I know a lot of people like my curls and stuff, but when I would straighten my hair as a kid, I would go to like, I was in like elementary school and stuff. And when I would straighten it, people would be like, you look better with straight hair. Like you should straighten your hair more often. And that like kills <laughs> to hear because when I was younger, like I hated my hair as most people with curly hair do. Most people don't like it growing up. Um, but then 
it doesn't help when you do straighten your hair a few times and people tell you that it looks better than your curls and that you should do it more often. It's just like, thanks. <laughs> yeah, I know if you have curly hair, you definitely know exactly what I'm talking about, but I don't know. I'm kind of scared to straighten it just because it, it, I don't really recognize myself when my hair is straight and it's like weird. It makes me feel really, really weird. And I'm like, what if I like it better? And I, I don't want the curls anymore, but yeah. The curls are amazing though. Thank you. Thank you very much. But um, I do want to see my hair straight again. I haven't straightened it in, I think it's been like two years. So yeah. You guys, if you haven't seen the most recent video, it's measuring you. So of all the props here. <laughs> My desk is such a mess. So I have this here. Oh. My phone's at 20%, guys. Harriet says, I gotta go. I may or may not be back. Well, thank you for joining. I will probably end the live before you get back, but thank you for being here anyway. There's a bug in here. Do you guys see that? It just flew. That's disgusting. Gross. Yeah, my little table here just has like random things. Random prop kind of stuff because I don't clean. Why are people saying eat the bug? Like, why would I eat it? I don't even know where it is. <laughs> I'm almost done with this. Olga, bug ASMR. Mm -hmm. He just wanted to be in the video, I guess. Just want to be part of it. Um, I'm probably gonna. Oh, there it is again. I don't know where it went. I'm probably gonna end the live kind of soon. Um, kind of soon, kind of soon, kind of soon. Just cause I don't know what time it is past nine now it's probably almost 9 30 at this point probably maybe even past 9 30 i don't even know and i have to work tomorrow i have to work tomorrow i don't want to <laughs> um and i've got to do some things 9 26 okay thank you for telling me shiny evie when I'm doing this, I can't see the time. Um, it's 2.26 where you are. And yes, I'm in Canada. I'm vegan and I'm, I'm not vegan. I should be though. Hi bestie, hello. my name like that oh <laughs> jeremiah i don't know if i even said it right i hope i did is it cold no it's hot out these days it's like 20 it's 20 something degrees today it's poutine fire well dg 
Poutine is uh, pretty fire. Smooth brother. I like that name. Yeah, can you see what I'm saying? I said no cap on. See down there. Thank you. And yes, light skin gang. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Seven pets. What pets? Seven pets. That's crazy. What guy? What do you guys have for pets? I feel like dogs are probably the most common pet in cats and fish. I used to have a pet bird. I used to have a pet gecko. I used to have pet bunnies. I've had uh, quite a few pets. Colton says the only pet I ever had were chickens. Wow. Four dogs, a cat, two dogs, three cats, two birds. Wow. Yes, I had a gecko. I got it for Christmas when I was a little wee child. Its name was Mr. Gecko, but then we later discovered that it's a girl. So, yeah. It, we still called it Mr. Gecko. That was a leopard gecko and it was very cute. Well, Shiny Evie, thank you for being here. I will see you later. Bye. Oops. Which one of my piercings is my favorite? Elise asks, and I would have to say my industrial. Because I want it. This has to be my favorite piercing. My industrial right there, if you guys can see it. But it's my favorite piercing because I wanted it for so long and it was my first real piercing. Like I had my three earlobes pierced, but then my industrial piercing was my first like non-lobe piercing. It was very painful. Healing was absolutely terrible, but it was worth it. Guys, I'm probably going to end the live in like five minutes. I keep burping, but like quietly so you guys can hear. I'm just gonna sit back and relax. Oh, hello, Chris. But yes, thank you for being here. Have a good night. Burping is more. I mean, maybe, maybe, guys. Sometimes the tapioca gets stuck in the straw. Mic screaming. Guys, should I do mic screaming? Ready? <gasps> Kidding. <laughs> I wouldn't. Watch out for next April Fools, though. Can't guarantee there won't be any pranks. On that day. <laughs> I think at 75 minutes I'll end it. So it's in two minutes. I will end it. Probably, I think. But yes, thank you to everybody who has joined tonight and asked me questions. My hair is type 3. I would say probably 3C. Don't don't you dare end. <laughs> I would stay if I could, but Mike says it's one of the best ASMR channels I've come across in years, and thank you. That really means a lot. Um, I <laughs> honestly, I still can't believe that I do this sometimes, and I, I love it. Honestly, I love creating content but sometimes i'm like i can't believe i do it you know it's fun and if anyone wants to start a channel i say do it because it's really fun it's very rewarding as well good night i have to go well thank you for joining cohen and i will see you next time
That wasn't very nice. The best is when you get to the bottom and you get all the goodies. Some people hate bubble tea because they hate the texture of this stuff, but I love the texture. coming out. Not a big fan of Boba Yao. A lot of people, like my mom, hates the texture of that stuff. I love it. And yes, I will be saving this. It will be up on my channel. I think that the blooper is up as well. I might delete that one because it was just, ugh, that was so annoying. Okay, guys. Um, I should probably end this live now. I'm just trying to think if there's anything I want to say other than thank you all for being here. All of the new subscribers, thank you. Um, yeah. I hate ending the lives because I always go to the end and then I see a, um, a uh, question that I like or a comment that I like. But yes, thank you all. I hope that you have an amazing night. It might not be the night for you. It might be the day or the morning, whatever. But thank you all for being here. And to the new viewers, thank you. And um, yeah.